coming. Hello, she made it. Welcome to New York. Oh, bigger suitcase this time. I love it. Peaceful Michelle has arrived. <laughs> Give me a spray. Oh, it just makes everything nice. So lovely. <laughs> refresh after refresh. refresh. Welcome to New York, yeah. Mom. And welcome you guys to another weekend in my life. My mom is here for a quick weekend. She's headed up to upstate New York on Monday. So she was like, can I come hang for the weekend? I was like, of course. We're having such a fun weekend. I'm so excited. And I can walk you past my new apartment, Mom. Oh, cool. I know. We're about to head over to 12 chairs in Soho. I'm so excited. I've always wanted to go. We're doing like a late lunch. And then, today's Friday, by the way. And then from there, we're going to the Morgan Museum and we're meeting up with her friend. And then we're going to see the musical, or is it a play? I think it's a musical. Play, I don't know. Oh. Like oh, okay. Well, we're going to see a show called Come From Away, and I've heard only amazing things. My trainer said she saw it, and it's really, really good. And then tomorrow, we're finally going to air Ancient Baths. It's my mom's very delayed Mother's Day gift. Really excited about that. And tomorrow night, we're going to see Into the Woods on Broadway. So lots of fun stuff happening and a ton of stuff in between, so I wanted to take you guys along. We have got to head out, but here is my fit check. It's so hot outside, the only thing I like could wear is like a dress. So. This dress is from Revolve. I'll link it below. I think it's still available. It's just like a fun floral dress. Super easy. And then of course, none other than my Ray shoes that are so comfortable, but they give me a little height, which I love. And then I'm gonna use my Bob or bag because I feel like it kinda, kinda goes. So we're gonna head out. I'm hungry. I know you're hungry too. My mom's wearing this super cute, nasty gal, little two piece set. Yes. Love it. All right. We're gonna head out. All right, we're headed to the Morgan Museum now. Quick museum trip before we go see the show. 12 chairs was so good, I get the hype. It was the, the hummus, the pita. I literally, she gave me a little bag. I have the pita in my purse for um, later when I'm hungry during the show. My secret pita purse. My secret pita purse. There it is. guys it's Saturday morning we've had a lovely morning I actually woke up before my mom so I got my video up and we just had a lovely morning I just showered she's in the shower now today we're doing all kinds of fun things but we are starting off by going to air ancient baths I literally like have this brochure so I thought I'd show you guys so you can kind of get a idea of what it is it's a very delayed Mother's Day gift because 
Long story short, there was some scheduling issues. I thought I scheduled our massages and bath time, <laughs> bath time, when she was here last time and I got the dates mixed up and so they basically like recredited me because um, I had already like paid for it all and so we were like, next time you come to New York, we're gonna go. So she's here and we're going. I'm so excited. So we're doing these baths and then we also are getting massages. I'm so excited. I've been once before. It is literally the most peaceful thing in the entire world. They also give you like juices and there's like a hot tub, a cold tub, like a wave one, like a warm one. It is so fun and I'm so excited, like seriously so excited. So we're starting the day by doing that. So we're actually going, you wear your swimsuit obviously because you're not alone in these baths. There's other people um, and they give you a robe. There's also a steam room. I highly suggest it's a great gift to give someone if they live in the city. I think they also have one in Chicago question mark. Oh my God, here's more photos. Like literally. Like, I just can't. Like, I'm showing you guys here because you can't bring cameras in there. It is so stunning. I'm wearing my new favorite swimsuit. It's from Hunza G, um, just because it's comfortable. And then this dress is from Revolve. I'm just wearing like a flowy, it's basically a cover up. And then I packed a tote bag because when we're done, we'll change into dry clothes, obviously. So I'm gonna bring a hairbrush too in case. I decided to get my hair wet, which maybe I shouldn't because I just got my hair done. And I don't really need my hair turning green today, you know? And then we'll come back and chill for a little bit, shower, get ready. And we're doing a dinner with Ryan. We're going to this place called Felice in West Village. Um, I believe it's Italian, so no complaints there from me. And then from there, my mom and I are going to see Into the Woods on Broadway. We're doing a double header, two shows in one weekend. I double header is probably two shows in one night, but yeah, whatever. I'm so excited because I was in Into the Woods in high school, if you guys remember the vlogs. I played one of Cinderella's stepsisters, so I'm so excited because I know literally every song. Like, I am going to be that theater girl in the theater singing every song, or mouthing it, maybe. We'll see, depending on who I'm sitting next to. <laughs> I'm kidding, no, I will not interrupt the show, but I will be mouthing along because I know all the words and I'm so excited. And my mom obviously saw it a few times when I was in it, so she's really excited. I think it's recently on Broadway. I think it was like playing at the Lincoln Center and now it's like on Broadway. I don't know, but I'm so excited. Sarah Bareilles is in it. I think she's the baker's wife I heard. So I, I'm just so excited. So we love dinner and a show. Um, we might have some idle time between doing the spa and then dinner, but I don't really know because we'll probably just want to come here and chill for a little bit. I'm so excited. Today is a lovely day. The weather is nice. Well, it's probably hot, but it's not raining. So happy Saturday. You excited for, Oh, you reading the brochure? Uh, yeah, anything about baths, ancient, and massage, I'm there. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> How do we feel? Oh, amazing. We got a couple's massage. I didn't know that was gonna be oh. happening. Um, we're walking around now. We showered, changed, and we're gonna stop by two hands and grab like a little snicky snack. And then I was like, our hair's all wet, you know? We like bathed there. Let's just stop by Dry Bar Tribeca and get blowouts. Oh my God. And she was like, I love it here. So that's what we're gonna do. say <laughs> we're going to dinner we're going to this restaurant called Felice on Hudson it's in the West Village I'm so excited it's Italian of course of course Ryan you excited to join the gals <laughs> mom your outfit is literally slaying I know, you, you look so cute you. that she was like do you have a green bag I was like how many do you need yeah. <laughs> you <laughs> look so cute you where's your dress from oh my gosh Veronica like Beard and then she's got a little Balenciaga mm -hmm. she's where your shoes from 
very called DSW. So DSW. Like yeah, we know what DSW is. Oh, okay. Cute. Yeah, no. And then here's my outfit. I love this top. It's from Revolve. It's so cute. It's my first time wearing it. And then I only have a month left of wearing white jeans. So I'm wearing these from Mother Jeans off of Revolve. And then, of course, my favorite shoes. And I'm using this bag. It's been my favorite bag because it like matches the shoes. Ryan, what, what are you wearing? What am I wearing? Um, Out for the day. Polo. I don't know where I got these pants from. And then um, clean. Yeah, they shoes. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. This looks so good. I got like the playing dress up with some of my clothes. I think you should wear that to brunch. It's so cute. It's from a store called Reformation. It fits you perfectly. Do you feel like Cinderella? I have to add my Into the Woods playbill to my drawer of playbills. These are all the shows I've seen since moving to New York. Um, I don't really know. Maybe I'll make something out of these. That's kind of like the goal. Like some wall art I feel like would be cool. I don't really know. The show was absolutely amazing. I literally knew the song, the words to every song. My mom would look over and I was just like singing. It was so exciting. That was the first show I've ever seen that I've been in. Um, so that was really cool. So that goes there. We're just getting ready for brunch. In front of us, or two rows in front of us, I kept seeing people like go ask this guy for photos during intermission. And I was like, oh my gosh, who is this man? And it was Anthony Ramos. He was in Hamilton. He was in In the Heights. He's been in a lot of other movies too. He was there, it looked like maybe with his mom or like a family member of some sort. It was very, very sweet. I think he has a friend from Hamilton that was in the show, like one of the actors in Into the Woods. So he was there and I heard him say, he was in Into the Woods in high school too, and I was like, <laughs> same buddy. Is that like we're both here? Like are we buddies now? <laughs> he was really, really cool. Um, so that was fun. The show was just so good. Like so good, so good. And Sarah Bareilles was the lead. So if you're a Sarah Bareilles fan, definitely go see it. There were also some other people that when they came on stage, everyone like freaked out and clapped. So unsure, but it was such a good show. Highly suggest, especially if you like know the show. So yeah, we're about to head to brunch. I'm, I think I'm going to wear this outfit. I like never really wear shorts, but it's so hot outside and I'm just like running out of like flowy dresses that I want to wear during the day and I've been wanting to wear this top. I think it's from For Love and Lemons. I love it, I will link it below. Like it's so stinking cute. Shorts are actually from Spanx and what I like about them, well I like the length, they're not too short. They um, are like, they made them extra, extra thick so that no matter what color underwear you're wearing, you can't see them. So we love that. We love some thick shorts. Um, so yeah, this is what I'm wearing. I don't know about shoes. I'll probably just wear my Air Forces because I don't know, I feel like sneakers and shorts, that's a vibe. Um, I just have to make sure I'm not gonna get a wedgie. I'm like trying to like walk around the apartment right now making sure I'm not gonna get a wedgie. Yeah, I think I need to put some like serum at my ends, but the blowout's still looking good. I'm going to use this purse. And that's it. I just used this Living Proof Frizz Vanishing Oil. And look how like nice my ends look now. They're not as like feathery, and it, but it doesn't look like greasy or anything. I'm really, I'm really happy with that. So I thought I'd tell you guys. All right, here is the final fit. I went with the Air Forces. Bag is from By Far. I like this outfit. It feels so fun and summery. Good morning. Good morning. I'm so hungry. So we were gonna try Bouvet, but it looks like there's a really long line. So now we're walking down the road to Little Owl. I've heard good things. I love this street, don't you? Yeah, it's beautiful over here. It's so beautiful. It's beautiful over here. <laughs> Ryan's showing us his new apartment. 
Good vibes. We've made it to Washington Square Park. Have you ever been here, Mom? It's like from a movie. Yeah. This is the only park that has that? Uh, yes. got back about an hour ago my mom just left um, I took a little nap on the couch so I have to like fix my makeup a little I'm making a cup of coffee it's currently raining <laughs> uh, and I'm going to a baseball game <laughs> the Mets are playing the Braves this weekend and uh, Ryan went to the game yesterday but he also would like to go today and we were doing like a double date situation with one of his friends and his girlfriend who just moved here who I love. Um, but it's like boring raid right now and I'm, I'm being that girl I'm like, you know, cause we're taking the train there. We gotta walk and all that. And I'm just, I'm just being a baby about the rain. Cause it's like pouring right now. And I'm all like cozy, but I did, I love a Sunday baseball game. We've done it before. It's such a vibe. I just would rather not go in the rain, you know? Um, so I'm just like working through that, <laughs> trying to figure it out what I want to do. Uh, and Ryan's obviously all in and like, I want to go. And the other couple's like, yeah, we're in. I'm like, really? It's pouring rain. Right? <laughs> um, so I don't know. I'm like, can we just wait till the rain dies down and then we go and get to the game a little late? But I don't know. I had a fabulous time with my mom though. We had such a lovely morning. Little Owl is so good. And you guys all told me that, I can't believe I didn't know this, Little Owl, where we ended up for brunch, which was so good. The French toast is seriously insane, you must get it. The building that Little Owl is in, like above it, is the friend's apartment, which I didn't know. So that, that was a really cool, fun fact. I have to take Delaney there because she loves friends. It's raining, it's boring, the old man is snoring. Ugh. Let's see, maybe this sip of coffee will revive me. I'm like, what do I even wear? Last time I went to a baseball game, I wore overalls, but it is far too hot for those today. I'm thinking just like a black tank and like denim shorts, but honestly, my shorts I was wearing earlier started to like rub. That was uncomfy in the heat. I'm just being like a weather annoyer right now. Anyways, that's what's going on. I wonder if I can just delay everybody going to the game a little bit later, but yeah. All right, she has revived. <laughs> um, we're just gonna go to this baseball game in the rain. It's just gonna happen. <laughs> I'm not trying to complain, I'm just like, I just like, you know, no one wants to sit in the rain, you know? But Ryan really wants to go to this game and I'm doing nothing else this afternoon. So we're gonna go. I think the rain's, we're thinking the rain's gonna stop by the time we get to the stadium. So we'll be in the train, it'll be dry and all that. It's just, once we get there, if it's raining, I'm not gonna be a happy camper, but that's okay. Anyways, you guys are like, Danielle, stop complaining. Here is the outfit. I'm wearing, actually this is also from Spanx. It's a Spanx day. Um, this tennis skirt is from Spanx. I really just love their clothing items. Um, it has little biker shorts underneath. I'll link them below. Tank top is Aritzia. My Lululemon fanny pack. And then I'm wearing my Air Force Ones. Go baseball. I, I want a hot dog for sure. So I am excited. back now it's 9 p.m. it was actually a really fun day we like played a drinking game like every time blah 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 what happened we take a step stuff like that it was my idea it was good times um and yeah never ended up raining so thankfully that worked out Ryan just went home to shower and then he's coming back over we're gonna make Caesar salad chicken Caesar salad for dinner um, I also got more Ithaca hummus because this stuff is my freaking jam it is so good. Got some Parmesan cheese, some croutons. I got cantaloupe for dessert because I love cantaloupe. 
and then some chicken. So when Ryan gets here, he'll make the chicken and we'll prepare some chicken Caesar salad. And we're gonna do a movie night because we always watch like a TV show together, which is fun. But we were like on the train with Adriana and Zach talking about movies. And in college, Ryan used to come over and we'd watch so many different movies. And I've watched so many good movies because of our movie nights. So I was like, we should watch a movie tonight. So we're trying to decide what to watch. It's already nine o'clock, we're eating dinner now, but we like had food at the stadium as well. So I'm excited, wholesome evening. I'm gonna take a shower though, cause I feel gross. Okay, I just opened up some Amazon boxes. I just showered, I put on a little sweat set. Um, I got this black like workout situation romper on Amazon. I think it was literally $12. So I'll let you guys know how it goes. I got a size medium. I'll link it below. So I ordered that from Amazon. And then I also, I, I'm doing an Amazon haul if I didn't say that. I also got this Vegamore Grow Revitalizing Shampoo and Conditioner because Brooke used this stuff in the DR and every time she showered it smelled so good in the bathroom. So partly because it smelled so good, but also it you know helps with hair growth and everything. I'm always trying to have healthy, long, luscious, thick hair. And then I also just went ahead and got the Grow um, Hair Serum that you put in your scalp and it's supposed to help. And this like has all the instructions and everything. So yeah, this stuff smells so good. I can't even explain it. It's like a dream. I wonder if even, yeah, it doesn't describe the scent, but it is so lovely. If you guys have used Vegamore, please comment down below and tell me if it actually has like helped. But yes, those are the things I got from Amazon. I also just got these Nippies skin because I actually borrowed Katie's when we were in Montauk. So I'm like a sticky boobs girl through and through. You guys always ask me like what bra I use or wear when I'm wearing like interesting cut tops and such. Sticky boobs. So it's just like, you know, adhesive bras. But these, I, I don't love nipple covers because I feel like it kind of looks weird with certain shirts because it's like prominent. But these are seriously... Like, like, it literally says, the smoothest coverage possible. I'll link it below for you guys. I'm so impressed. These have like more um, surface area than like the smaller nipple covers as well. And it is just, it literally is like second skin. I feel like it feels like nothing is on you. And it looks so good too if you wanna wear like sheer mesh shirts. Like this looks honestly like skin. It's just so impressive. So I had to get my own pair. So I will link these below too. All right guys. Ryan and I are in a debate, and now I'm like not sure if I have the popular opinion or not. So I'm cutting up this lettuce. My preferred part of the lettuce is the this side, like the lighter, and apparently the darker green is definitely more nutritious. But all lettuce is good for you, obviously. Anyways, I like this. It's crunchier, it's, it's colder, it's better. Ryan takes, I'm like chopping and he's like, he thinks he's doing me a favor and like takes all this and throws it away. And I'm like, no, that's the best part. So Ryan says, so you like this stuff better? I like the non-stem part. He likes the non-stem part. I mean, I don't eat the stem. I throw that away. But this is not as tasty as this. So I please comment down below, you guys, where your head's at with this. Because now I'm unsure. Because Ryan's team this. I'm team that. Oh my gosh, I'm just so confused. But yeah, chicken just finished. Okay, where is it? Oh! Wait, good job! And then we've got the... um. Parmesan and the croutons. Okay guys, this looks pretty darn good. I don't use Caesar dressing, or I don't use dressing. I like a vinaigrette, but on this, I'm just gonna eat it as is. So we've got this big bowl and we'll, we'll share from this. Ryan's making more chicken. Yum! We also decided on a movie, which I should probably just get started here in a second because it's already late. We're gonna watch The Truman Show. I'm very excited. It's about, it's Jim Carrey. A, a lot of you guys have probably already seen it, but Jim Carrey, basically, there's a TV show that's running about him for 24 hours, and he has no idea. Like, basically, everyone sees his every move every day, and, like, when he was born, like, he was bought, and, like, everyone watches him now, but, like, in a, like, a show way. I just don't know how he doesn't see it on TV, but I'm excited to watch it. Ryan hasn't seen it either. It's always nice watching a movie that we both haven't seen, so, yeah. All right guys, Ryan just left because he has to wake up super early tomorrow morning for work. We didn't finish the movie. We both fell asleep and like woke up. My toxic trait is literally like wanting to start a movie or read or something at night and being like, yeah, I'm like wide awake. Like we should watch something and then falling asleep 30 minutes in for the movie. For books, it takes me like three pages and then I get so tired. So 
I'm gonna head to bed. That ends this weekend in my life. It was such a lovely, lovely weekend with my mom and Ryan and just being back in New York City and doing some fun city things. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I love you guys so much. And I'll see you soon for our next video. Bye.